so this notion that just because you've been all this hype and you've been kicking ass in France all these years, that don't mean nothing when you step on the court next year. We got uh, probably going to be the third best team in Texas. <laughs> just in Texas. Victor Wembanyama, standing at an imposing 7-3, etched his name in the annals of history by becoming the number one overall pick in the 2023 NBA draft, donning the jersey of the San Antonio Spurs. His rapid and remarkable rise to prominence has sent shockwaves echoing throughout the basketball community over the past few months. What sets him apart isn't solely his extraordinary height, it's also his remarkable ball-handling finesse and a deadly jump shot. This extraordinary blend of attributes is virtually unparalleled for a player of his colossal stature. It comes as no surprise that he's ignited a firestorm of excitement, emerging as one of the most keenly anticipated prospects in the storied history of the NBA. Now, let's delve into the insights of several NBA legends concerning this extraordinary French basketball prodigy. Victor Wembanyama, an NBA icon and a once-in-a-generation talent, has garnered profound praise from one of Europe's basketball legends, Dirk Nowitzki. The Dallas Mavericks legend heaped acclaim on the first pick of the 2023 draft, stating, You always think you've seen it all and then Wembanyama comes around, a 7-5 guy. I watched a highlight the other day and he shot a step back from three and then got a putt back. I mean, who does that? You gotta be skilled, you gotta be quick to the ball, you gotta be long. It's scary how talented this kid is. So long, the skill level can dribble, can shoot. Hopefully he can stay healthy. That's the only thing that can hold him back. I think everything else, I've heard he's got the work ethic, he's a smart kid, he wants to be great, he's putting in the work, and we're all here to support him and see his full potential. We're all rooting for him, hopefully his body holds up. Scary talent, basketball Hall of Famer and revered Dream Team member Chris Mullen aligns with the enthusiastic admirers of Victor Wembanyama. Mullen shared his anticipation, stating, Victor Wembanyama is a unique talent. I am really looking forward to watching him. When he came over to the showcase in Vegas, he really, really impressed me as a player. Someone we haven't seen the likes of before. When you look at his stats from Europe, he almost averages a double-double. He also has great vision and is very comfortable inside and out. He is playing at both sides of the ball. He has a three-point shot. The efficiency is also there. So when you have numbers like this from a big man, three blocks per game, that is Shaq numbers combined with all his other skill sets, I think he is a combination of a lot of players. There has never been a guy that plays like him. Really a unique talent. Wembanyama is undoubtedly a player with the potential for all-time greatness. However, given his unique background, some individuals remain cautious, preferring to witness his NBA performance before fully embracing the hype. Charles Barkley recently weighed in on this matter, offering advice to Wembanyama while underlining the considerable challenges the San Antonio Spurs face in their pursuit of an NBA championship. Regarding Victor's desire for a championship ring in the coming season, Barkley remarked, It's unwise to get caught up in all the hype just because you've been dominating in France for all these years. That doesn't necessarily translate to success on the NBA court next year. The Spurs aren't on the cusp of winning a championship, young fella. It's highly unlikely you'll even make the playoffs next year. Chuck humorously added that the Spurs would probably rank as the third best team in Texas the following season. Wembanyama's talents are undeniable, and there's a reason for the immense hype surrounding him. But some prefer to exercise caution and await his performance at the highest level before wholeheartedly embracing it. Tony Parker, a French basketball legend with deep ties to the San Antonio Spurs, provides valuable insights based on his 17-year career with the Spurs, including four championships and a strong connection with the team's French fan base. He stated, I know he wanted to come to San Antonio, and it feels like destiny, given the French connection we've built over the years. He's set to continue the legacy, which is pretty remarkable. He's a unique talent with a skill set unlike any we've seen before. A player of his size, shooting ability, dribbling skills, and unique style of play, it's truly something different. I'm eagerly looking forward to seeing him in action with the Spurs. He doesn't seem to be bothered by the pressure and expectations, and I believe the Spurs are the perfect fit for him. He's in good hands, and he's already displaying that quality. Victor Wembanyama's commanding presence on the basketball court, marked by a remarkable combination of height, athleticism, and skill, is genuinely awe-inspiring. Gilbert Arenas made it crystal clear when he labeled the French talent as a budding star. Even before his NBA debut, 
Yet, Agent Zero suggests that there are two players who might offer substantial challenges to the young star. In his words, I think he's destined for stardom. Why? Well, because there are only two centers he needs to concern himself with. He's essentially a seven-foot-tall Kevin Durant. He'll have to battle with the process from Philadelphia for two games and Nikola Jokic for six. Wemby is undeniably one of the most exciting prospects in recent memory. When discussing the French prodigy's potential, NBA legend Kevin Garnett drew comparisons to the two most recent European MVPs, the Greek Freak and the Joker. In an effort to underscore the exceptional polish Wemby has displayed from an early age, Garnett remarked, If we go back and look at Joker, he looked pretty average back then. They called him Chunky. We didn't give him the respect he deserved. Remember the Greek Freak's ascent? The Greek Freak had one of the most incredible runs. He resembled a blend of Shaq with KD's skills. He was nailing three-pointers, bringing the heat. Neither the Greek Freak nor Joker displayed this level of polish as prospects at Wemby's age. So he seamlessly fits into the narrative we're discussing. In a recent interview, NBA icon Shaq shared his perspective on Victor's future. The Big Diesel isn't quite ready to declare Wemby as an absolute superstar just yet. Despite acknowledging the young talent's once-in-a-generation potential, Shaq expressed his reservations, noting, No, and I'm a bit skeptical because of the good and bad things about highlights. When you put your highlights on, you always show the good parts. I want to see this kid play a full game. He's not very big, he's tall, but he's building up a lot of muscles. Not that strong. He can shoot, he can dribble, he can do all that. I haven't really seen a lot of post moves. We haven't seen a lot of that stuff. But I'm only seeing highlights of him dunk the ball and shoot jumpers. So again, now you could be a star in France. When you come over here, you definitely have to start all over. A lot of guys have a lot of hype and came over here, some played out and some didn't. So I'm going to be more on the skeptical side like Charles is on this one. Reggie Miller, an additional NBA legend, is eagerly looking forward to observing what the top draft pick can contribute to the Spurs. However, he also carries apprehensions regarding Victor's physical well-being, drawing from his own career for context. Miller underscored the significance of steering clear of injuries and the potential consequences they may have on Victor's promising journey. He stated, My sole concern is, he resembles my stature at 705. I rarely had any injuries throughout my 18-year career, just a few ankle issues. Nevertheless, I primarily operated on the perimeter, not engaged in physical battles with the big guys. But the game is not as rugged as it was in the 80s and 90s, so he won't endure the same level of physicality. I simply hope he remains injury-free. I fervently wish for his sustained health and, based on what I've observed in videos and scouting reports, if he performs as projected, the future belongs to him. I'm genuinely thrilled for him. Acknowledging Victor Wembanyama's remarkable preparedness for the NBA, the 2022 LNB All-Star Game MVP has consistently remained in the spotlight throughout the season. In a Let It Be Known video published just before the 2023 NBA Draft, Isaiah Thomas, a Hall of Famer and Pistons legend, lauded Victor. He commented, We've got the Olympics coming up in Paris. The French team. Victor, I can't say his last name. Victor's going to be the number one pick in the draft, standing so big. He's the top pick in the draft, no doubt. I can't even describe him. He's so big. You know, he's shaking it between the legs, finger rolling it like George Gervin, slam dunking. He's poised to revolutionize the face of the NBA. So, Victor, let it be known. Chris Mullins' former teammate, Tim Hardaway Sr., shared his thoughts on Victor's exceptional talents during an appearance on The Carton Show. The former Golden State and Miami Heat point guard is profoundly impressed by Wemby's skill set and foresees a remarkable journey with the San Antonio Spurs right from the outset. He remarked, This kid is a tremendous basketball player entering a prestigious organization with a strong culture, and I'm confident he'll have an outstanding career. The San Antonio Spurs have secured an excellent pick and a remarkable player. I assure you he'll thrive with San Antonio. Greg Popovich and the Spurs' staff excel at nurturing young talent and enhancing their basketball prowess. If he manages to average 20 points, he'll undoubtedly tally 10 rebounds. Those will just naturally fall into his hands. Considering his passing skills and abilities, he should be able to contribute around 5 or 6 assists. So 20, 10, and 6 would constitute a solid rookie season for a prospect of this caliber. Victor is a one-in-a-generation talent. He has gotten some praises from these NBA legends, but what are your thoughts on the young star? Let us know in the comments down below.